Yo, what's good, everybody? Hope you're having a super blessed day. And Alabama, what, what are y'all doing? Can, can y'all leave some five-star running backs for the rest of us? Yo, a couple of weeks ago, Alabama picked up the third best running back in the country in Justice Haynes. And then they went and doubled up and got another five-star running back in the second best running back in the country and the sixth best player in Florida in Richard Young. Alabama just need all the running backs, I guess. They, they just need all the running backs, I guess. Comment down below right now, who do you guys like better between Justice Haynes and Richard Young? I To me, both of these guys are just, they're, they're just both dogs. Like, it, it, it's hard, like these two dudes are both dogs. Also, Alabama continues to show that they can go out and pick a player from whatever state that they want, split all that, get them a ball for you. Get them a ball for you. Alabama can go to whatever state they want and get whatever player that they want. Going and picking up one of the best players in the state. Actually, Alabama's got the three of the best, uh, three of the top four players from the state of Georgia. They got the number one, number two, and number four player in Georgia. Again, showing that they can go wherever they want. And then picking up a top 10 player in Florida. Just absolutely phenomenal. Especially a, t a highly coveted player in Richard Young, who you already, like, the Crimson Tide already have a top tier, a premier level running back in this recruiting class already. And then they just doubled back. They just doubled down on that. Yeah. Richard Young, this dude, he is just a flat out work horse. He can, he like whatever you need him to do, he can just flat out get it done. Like 5'11", 200, solid burst on the top end, runs 10'8 in the 100, which for running backs is absolutely, I mean, for anybody that's phenomenal, but especially for a running back his size, absolutely phenomenal runs with power solid acceleration solid vision again whatever you ask him to do again him i think that i think that richard young is a little bit more of a power back compared to justice hands i think justice likes to be a little bit more elusive i mean just look at him just run through the face of this dude just absolutely cuts up field runs through him nope then cut back nope bounces to the outside you ain't touching me you ain't stopping me get one block and that's into the crib yeah Alabama, y'all, y'all just having fun at this point. Y'all just like, hmm, who, who, who can we go pick up? Oh, we, we already got, we already got a four-star quarterback. Let's go get another four-star quarterback. Oh, we already got a five-star running back. Let's go get another five-star running back. I'm telling y'all, Alabama's just having fun right now. For also, for as much as Nick Saban's been complaining, y'all have had a great recruiting class. I don't know what Nick Saban's talking about. He must have missed out on a couple of recruits because normally Nick Saban get whoever he want, but literally. I, I I didn't see a drop off in, since NILs came around. Like NIL came around, and you would have thought that Nick Saban would have been out here just, oh, I'm not getting nobody. You still getting everybody that you want. Again, just sliding on him. Again, he he has like he has that Ezekiel Elliott type running style where it's it's explosive but fast like or it's like it's powerful and fast if you know what i mean like when you see like especially like prime like ohio state rookie year zeke man with his ability to be able to go from that four four speed to running somebody over to making a jump cut to then hitting the guy with a stiff arm i feel like that's where a guy like richard young and uh zeke have very similar running styles get sliding on them let's go yeah, phenomenal. Comment down below. Phenomenal pickup. This is a hey, this Alabama is R is RBU. Y'all, I mean, look at the footwork. Look at the footwork. Change of direction. Boom. Six foot in the ground. Slips a little bit. Keeps the balance. Accelerates. Breaks through all that. Nope. Nope. Spin through that. Get an extra five yards after contact. Let's go. Yeah, Richard Young is a absolute dog out here. Uh, thank you. We're going the other way with that. Yeah, he does a good job of when he makes it, when he puts that foot into the ground, he's not losing speed. Like, he can change direction without losing much speed, which, that, it's up there. That's, like, top three traits that you need to see in running backs. Like, if you're, if you can make guys miss, but then you're just at a dead standstill after that, it's like, all right, it's cool, but like, you can't make multiple guys miss. Richard Young is a guy who can make multiple guys miss while maintaining speed. <laughs> and then he just has this, uh, run him over.
So that is what the Alabama Crimson Tide's latest five-star pickup in the second best running back in the country and the sixth best player in Florida and Richard Young is looking like on the field. Like I said, I don't even think it was, it might have been like one, maybe two weeks ago, y'all picked up five-star running back Justice Haynes, the third best running back in the country. And then you came back and picked up the second best running back in the country in Richard Young. I think both of those dudes are going to be one of the most deadly backfield combinations that Alabama has ever seen. And Alabama's seen some crazy running back backfield. I mean, you had the Derrick Henry, Mark Ingram, but at both Scarborough days, like where all those guys were like on the roster at one point and they were just kind of just like filtering back and forth. Like Alabama is just absolutely loaded up in the backfield. This is, I think that Alabama might be getting back to their running ways. Now that they know that they can, they, they can spread the ball around and they got receiving weapons, I think now they're going to start going back to the running game, really pounding the rock and then being able to just take the top off the defense with their, with their newfound passing game. Alabama continues to revolutionize, evolutionize, all, all the F and I's and whatever's. They continue to change the game and they continue, that's why they stay at the top consistently. Like I said, I don't know why Nick Saban's been complaining. Y'all get whoever y'all want still. Like you might miss out on like five recruits in a recruiting season and you will still come down with multiple five-star recruits at the same position, picking up top 10 players at the same position. Like. Alabama is going to be doing just fine. Alabama is always going to be, in, as long as long as Coach Saban is there, y'all going to be in great hands. A phenomenal, phenomenal pickup for the Alabama Crimson Tide in five-star running back Richard Young. Alrighty, I know that y'all enjoyed this video, so firstly, be sure to hit that like button. Secondly, comment down below, what do you guys think of Richard Young joining the, joining the Crimson Tide? Absolutely, I, I did not expect, I, I did not expect him to go to Alabama. I didn't really know where he would go, but once Justice Haynes went there, I was like, eh, he's probably not going to be going to Alabama. Eh, double down. Got him to go to Alabama. Also, comment down below. Who do you guys think is better of the two between Richard Young and Justice Haynes? I, to me, it's, it's too close to call. Actually, I made a video going over the top running backs. So if you guys want to go watch that, you guys can check that video out. But yeah, both of, these guys, both of those guys are just absolute dogs. And with that being said, hit that subscribe button. We're on the road to 300,000 subscribers, and we keep you up to date with all the latest college football recruiting news. I love and appreciate all y'all, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Ciao.